Welcome to Waiting for the One Grace Podcast. Scriptures from New Living Translation Bible. We begin our episode with the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you, Abba, Father, for your Son, Jesus. The bread that represents Jesus' body. The painful scourging on Jesus' body created stripes. For every stripe on Jesus' back when he was scourged is for our healing that we will ever need in each of our lives. Jesus' precious blood washes all our sins when we believe in him and we place our life in his hands and claim that he is Lord and believe in our heart that God raised Jesus from the dead. And when we do that, we become right with God the Father. Jesus' precious blood that washes all our sins makes us right with you, God the Father. And without you, Jesus, I wouldn't be here. And a lot of our audience would agree too. So thank you on my behalf of myself and on the behalf of others who feel the same. For your love thank you for your love, your obedience to follow through God's plan and to die for all of us sinners. Amen. Today we will be singing chorus number one and verse number four for our song perspective. If you know the words, please join in. Let us begin. Let's raise up our hands and stomp in the stands. Let's use our voice so Jesus hears your, our choice. No human on this earth would be able to endure that specific pain Jesus endured. Nor would they be eligible to administer every cure. Because no one on this earth is sinless and pure. For Jesus is the one who has the authority to administer the cure. The first scripture of the day is Psalm 110, 1 to 4. The Lord said to my lord sit in the place of honor at my right hand until i humble your enemies making them a footstool under your feet the lord will extend your powerful kingdom from jerusalem you will rule over your enemies when you go to war, your people will serve you willingly. You are arrayed in holy garments, and your strength will be renewed each day like the morning dew. The Lord has taken an oath and will not break his vow. You are a priest forever 
in the order of Melchizedek. The next scripture is 1 Timothy 6, 17 to 21. Teach those who are rich in this world not to be proud and not to trust in their money, which is so unreliable. Their trust should be in God, who richly gives us all we need for our enjoyment. Tell them to use their money to do good. They should be rich in good works and generous to those in need, always being ready to share with others. By doing this, they will be storing up their treasure as a good foundation for the future, so that they may experience true life. Timothy, Guard what God has entrusted to you. Avoid godless, foolish discussions with those who oppose you with their so-called knowledge. Some people have wandered from the faith by following such foolishness. May God's grace be with you all. The next scripture is 2 Timothy 1, 12 to 14. That is why I am suffering here in prison, but I am not ashamed of it, for I know the one in whom I trust, and I am sure that he is able to guard what I have entrusted to him until the day of his return. Hold on to the pattern of wholesome teaching you learned from me, a pattern shaped by the faith and love that you have in Christ Jesus. Through the power of the Holy Spirit who lives within us, Carefully guard the precious truth that has been entrusted to you. The next scripture is 1 Peter 3, 15 to 18. Instead, you must worship Christ as Lord of your life. And if someone asks about your Christian hope, always be ready to explain it, but do this in a gentle and respectful way. Keep your conscience clear, then if people speak against you, they will be ashamed when they see what a good life you live because you belong to Christ. Remember, it is better to suffer for doing good, if that is what God wants, than to suffer for doing wrong. Christ suffered for our sins once for all time. He never sinned. But he died for sinners to bring you safely home to God. He suffered physical death, but he was raised to life in the Spirit. Now we have extra suggestive reading. Psalm 110, 1 to 7, OC, space, dollar sign, HRR, dollar sign. 1 
Timothy 6, 1-21, NC, dollar sign, HRR, dollar sign. 2 Timothy 1, 1 1-18, NC, dollar sign, HRR, dollar sign. 1 Peter 3, 1 1-22, NC, dollar sign, HRR, dollar sign. Tomorrow we will be singing our song perspective, chorus number one, verse number. Now for our suggestive videos. In our talks category found in our podcast playlist, How Precious Your Blood Is Jesus. In our BB series, Who crowned great honor in our first series the journey of the cross the key piece finding your way in our imr category thank you jesus for paying our sin debt in full revealing the cross Jesus, my strength. And in our I am category, a secret key revealed. Thank you to all of our audiences. God bless each one of you. Along with having a God blessed, thankful thumbs up Thursday for each one of all ourselves, our family members, our families, our furry friends, our friends, and our neighbors. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen.